Hi, how to create and print an index from a PDF. So to do this, you need an Acrobat plugin called PDF Bookmark Print. Once they have that installed, just open your PDF in Acrobat. Click on Plugins, Bookmark Print. Now I check the Print Index Only checkbox at the bottom. Select all, if you, if you want all the bookmarks included in the index, then select all. So this includes all the nested ones as well. Then click on File, Setup. In here, I just want to print the index. I don't actually want to print the pages themselves. So don't print pages, just print index. Now you can change your font size and the other settings to whatever you want. So I'm going to do it to 18 font size in this case. Click Save and Exit. Then click Print. So it would print it via Adobe Acrobat itself. You can see on the right hand side the preview of how it's created the index, which is exactly what I wanted, all the pages. And then you can just click print. If you want to keep a copy of it, then you just print it to a Adobe PDF printer. If you don't have one, then there's a free one called Print to PDF Pro. Just search for that and you'll find that. So you just click print. And that's it. It'll print to your printer, just the index. And it's as simple as that. If you want to actually export it to an um, Excel file, you can also do that. If you click on reports, export bookmark names to CSV file. You can also do it in nested format as well if you want to. In this case, I'm going to do it in nested format. And you just type in your file name, test, and it will create the CSV file. So it would look like this. You can just delete that first column. It's not really needed. And you can see that it's got indentation for the nested ones. So then you can just format it how you want and change the fonts and things like that. So if you want to change the format cells, alignment. So you want it centered, you can do that. Then click on file, print. And we'll print it exactly like that. So that's another way of doing it. It's a free trial available on our website. You can just download, install it, and run it in full version of Acrobat Pro. Give it a try.